Salud. It's good to see you again. Hey, uh, yeah, I'm excited about something I wanted to share with all of you. And uh, I've been talking about a project that I've been working on for a while. And uh, so I've done a thing and uh, it came in the mail today. I'm gonna let you see it in just a second. So, this box arrived in the mail today, and it is actually much, much heavier than I would have thought. And there's not really much that I can show you right now. It's just pieces and parts. So, let me move this aside. Have a sit down. And at this point, if I'm doing this right, I can edit this and show you what it is. So, I've been ordering diorama parts from, uh, from a website called uh, Hole in the Wall Productions. And, uh, of course, the link's going to be down below. I'm probably right now showing you something like uh, uh, a, a screenshot of their web page. You should just go there and check it out. They got all kinds of great stuff. You know, you can recreate uh, play sets from your childhood, uh, maybe with a little bit more uh, cinematic realism. Um, and you can create all the ones you never had. And obviously what I'm working on here is the cantina. Well, a while back, oh, I have to say it was about three, four months ago, um... Uh, Hole in the Wall Productions did a crowdsource, crowdfund, whatever you call it, crowdfund, uh, for the cantina. Now, the thing is, I had already gotten the bar and uh, all the, the stuff that goes on the bar and uh, a bunch of the tables and chairs and, you know, stuff. And I was getting ready to build it all from scratch, the... Uh, the, the walls and the cubicles and, and the entryway and all of that kind of thing. And then this went up. And uh, so now hopefully I'm probably showing you the, uh, the, the kickstart and, you know, some of the pictures from it. And uh, I got real excited. And, you know, he's got the different tiers as you expect for, you know, uh, a, a kickstart of this kind. But it's a little bit different because... Unlike uh, where he's trying to get together the, 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 the funds to, to start something up, he'd already done all the work except for the printing. So he basically just wanted the material, excuse me, the money for the material uh, and to know how much he was going to need for how many of these units he was going to make. So uh, it actually worked out that uh, rather than, um, you know, some people uh, uh, will start uh, sending uh, materials out, uh, you know, based on uh, levels, it kind of was counterintuitive because I was somewhere in the middle. I was getting all of the wall units and everything, but I wasn't getting the bar and I wasn't getting any of the accoutrement. Um, he said, you know what, I'm just going to send you yours and a bunch of other people that just ordered small sections and whatnot. And the people that are getting the whole kit and caboodle, they'll get that later. Again, it was very heavy. So uh, I didn't even look yet to see what the, you know, what it might have cost to ship. But I was very pleased with the price that I paid for this. Now there's a, still a lot of work that I'm going to have to do myself. I've, uh, I've already uh, put on my uh, my shopping list some uh, some spray paint because uh, I want to paint it that uh, that uh, stucco type color and and whatnot uh, before I assemble it, and then I got to assemble the whole thing. I'm probably going to assemble it in segments so it can be taken apart, and of course I'm going to uh, you know kind of up the details because you know I mean I can't you know. Um, 
so I'll be doing another video later on as I'm getting parts of it together and whatnot and show you what's happening. But I wanted to point you guys towards, uh, towards hole in the wall production. I have been getting stuff from them for a long time. Uh, you know, like I said, I was getting those tables and chairs. I got the bar. Everything comes very, very quickly. The, it, 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 it's an incredible turnaround. What, what shocks me the most is that I got this whole cantina. Uh, I wasn't expecting this until late June. That was the estimate that was on the kickstart. And here we are, you know, halfway through May, you know, so I'm, I'm pretty pleased. Um, which means I get to get started on this and maybe have the whole thing, you know, put together and finished by summer, which will really make my wife happy because that means I can clear off the dining room table. Anyway, so uh, I'm going to end it here. Go check out uh, the page. I'll probably be talking uh, more about Hole in the Wall Productions, you know, as as uh, I do uh, continue to do this series talking about this project. So thanks so much for joining me. Take care. Salute. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye for now.